Let's talk for a moment about your storehouse of memory. Your storehouse of memory is like a gas tank. And if you fill your car with the wrong type of gas, it will stall and it will cease to run. If you fill your mind with the wrong memories and hold on to them, you'll cease to run and you'll break down. You need to take an inventory of your memories. The good ones, hold on to, savor. The bad ones, be willing to let go. The human being often thinks that, well, I need to hold on to the bad memories because they were learning experiences and they will serve me later. But they are like drinking poison and holding that poison inside. As a teenager in Silver Spring, Maryland, I went into a gas station one time and filled up my car. And the gas station, I didn't know it at the time, they had watered down their gas. And my car, which was an old car, it started to sputter and it eventually stalled. It eventually wouldn't run. It took a long time before we realized that the gas station was selling watered gas. And a lot of other people found that out too. Well, your memories are a storehouse for good or bad. I pray that you'll decide to live the rest of your life using your memory as a vehicle that can power your life that your memories will be a storehouse of good experiences. In Psalms 111, verse 4, it says, He has caused His wonderful works to be remembered. The Lord is gracious and merciful. I pray that you live in the present, not the past. And I pray also that you do have cherished memories that continue to enrich your life, your current daily life, I pray that you have retained in thought the good that you've learned and experienced. Uppermost in mind, I pray that you remember your spiritual nature as a child of God. I pray that you live in a wonderful, beautiful world that God created, but Really, we live from the inside out. We live from our perceptions in our mind. And I pray that your whole mind is filled due to your inventory that you take with a storehouse of positive memories, memories of good. Today is a day to live, to give, and to love, and to nourish a growing awareness of God's presence within you. It is a day to realize more deeply than ever your relationship to God. Every day is a day for creating new memories of God's goodness. Your memories become a storehouse of good experiences that feed you, that fuel your life. You have deep appreciation for all the good that has been received and for all the good that is now apparent and for all the good that is yet to be revealed. 